came from a radio environment doing VHF, UHF receivers, and that kind of spawned a lot of our initial products. So a lot of our amplifiers, switches, things like that, 6 gigahertz and below. Yeah, we're looking yeah. for bear die yeah. and um, 20 gig and good social That was a challenge to find it in a bear die option. Oh, yeah. Everybody else is selling a package. I feel like these guys are really going to help you out with the difference. That's right. That's cool. Thanks, guys. Cheers yeah. to 10 years. All right. All right. Woo! Bye to you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, listen, it's, uh, it's a great week here already at the IMS. Uh, Custom Mimic celebrating 10 years. What an achievement. Um, but guys, I really want to know, what's it like to have a Custom Mimic on your line card? When the customer has a problem, they help solve the problem for the customer, I'm not saying it's your problem. They help figure out what the issue is and then solve the problem for them. And employee-owned companies just seem to do a lot better. I mean, they're extremely responsive. The customers love them. They've got leading-edge technology. They've got great delivery. Phenomenal customer support. And when you combine all of those things together, you're a successful organization. Business Agreed. comes your way. You, you know, what, 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 do you, what, what, what are you feeling is really like? Well, their amplifiers, their LNAs, and everything are you know first in class. I mean, the GAN amplifiers that they're doing these days, they've been really good at customizing for the markets that they see where the revenue is going to be and Paul's been very good at going to talk to customers directly to see what they want and need and come up with solutions for them and then he comes back six months later and says is this what you want right. and there it is right. yeah single positive bias footprints that match companies that are obsoleting parts yep and you know development kits available in a day or two where it takes the other guys four to six weeks to get you a development kit or some companies that now, and or some companies that want you to pay for a debt for an email board. Yeah. yeah. You so. mentioned single positive bias. Did you run into a customer really that that was really a good fit for? Raytheon. Why is it was it about easier that? board layout, yeah. you know? Yeah. Easier manufacturing lower, lower cost. You know, components, you have less components in your whole design. So yep. you're reducing a whole bunch of bias, sequencing yep, exactly. circuits and tree and so forth. Yep. Yeah. Cool guys here. Right. Cheers. 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 Thanks Cheers. guys. So we're here with a couple of uh, customers and friends uh, from Plextech. Uh, Graham and Liam, why don't you tell, me, tell us a little bit about you, know, you guys and why you're here and why you're celebrating with these guys. Because they host the top quality beer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we, we've, we've known them for many years and uh, we've been uh, impressed with the steady stream of new products they've been developing and uh, it's great to see them successful. Most recently we've been doing a lot of uh, development work in 5G. And, uh, Heard of it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's quite interesting. Um, a lot of work going on, nobody's really sure what's, what it's going to be, but everyone's too scared not to do it. <laughs> we used the, the distributed amplifier we used in the receiver module, 192, so that worked quite nicely. Yeah. Um, uh, nice blowback. It's got a nice positive gain so far as well. Uh, here's the next here's 10 to the years. next 10 years. Yeah. Yeah. Congratulations guys. Anything you want to say, John? 10 more coming at you.